This is Raiden from Black Force Airsoft 6 doing a not a loadout video just to review all my stuff put together. I do have a loadout video, so please go check that out on Black Force Airsoft 6. Um well I'm gonna start off with some of my or two of my pistols. I have the HFC Darkhawk, which is right here. And just today, I messed it up. I did the feeding lip. I had to take it off. I had to get a new one. It, mine broke off. Um, just today, I did, do not drop your gas pistol mag. Just don't. So it will break on you. And I have the non-blowback HK USP CO2 version. 16 round mag and the other one is 26 rounds now what I use on my pistol my HSC Darkhawk is I have a tactical Crusaders pro paint adapter it just screws on there um, and with that I use soft air um, power booster, silicone spray, and I also use this propane. Two of these, this one's almost empty. Um, that's what I use on my pistol and on my helmet. My helmet, it's a Mitch 2000 replica, really cheap, it's like $27. And I have a GoPro Hero 3 here, and I have ESS full seal goggles. Um, the clear lens, clear tan lens, so. That's for my helmet. And some of my, or my gun, is the Lancer Tactical M4S system. It's a really nice gun. Um, externally, kind of disappointed. Um, I mean, it is, it is kind of cheap externally, but it performs pretty good. Now here I have my M4 style speed loader. Just pop up the button. And then there's a little tab right here. You gotta pull forward. And that locks into place. And here I have mid cap, high cap, high cap, mid cap, mid cap, mid cap, mid cap. I have one two, three, four, five mid caps and two high caps. This one's a flash mag, that's why I do not have a mag pull on it, but um, I just, for my mag pull, I use um nylon strap from like an old book bag or something and some electrical tape. Works fine, just fine. And what I hold those in is a paintball belt. It double stacks and four and four mags. So I'll show you that. You have two here, and it just you easily just slide in, just like any other double stack and four mag pouch. But it is kind of loose in here, so I do keep the Velcro strap on with some D rings. But that's that. That's what I run on my. It just goes around your waist, velcros around your waist. And for my holster, I have the just a Crossman, I think something like that. I got it from Walmart. It just goes in your belt, put your belt through here. Um, it holds the Dark Hawk fine. That's what I'm currently using. Well, not now until I get my little tab for my mag feeding lip. Here's my Condor dump pouch. I got it from 321 Airsoft. Um, I just took it onto my belt. I do not have a Molly vest right now. I'm planning on getting the Molly or the Condor Recon chest rig. 
and hook it on into there and I just use a regular belt and nothing special. Now for my gloves, they're really nice. They're not like airsoft gloves or anything, but they are Carhartt flex gloves. They're really nice. They fit my hands well. Um, and it does kind of keep you warm too. So, and here is just my Woodland Camo BDUs. Got them from the flea market. They work just fine. And here's my like head wrap shema, whatever you want to call it, I guess. Um, and here's just the battery that came with my laser tactical gun. And here's the charger. And it's uh, an extra battery. And, well, I guess that was it for my gear review. This is Braden from Black Force Airsoft 6. Thank you.